Even Marty, the degenerate, who's an alcoholic by 12. Uncle Donald, he hands me this shiny wee box. He's going on and on. Open it, boy, open it. You'll love the surprise. Thing is, I already know that it's a major Howl action figure. I was a nosy bastard. So, I open it up. I look right at my uncle and act surprised. He sees right through me. <laughs> right? Out of nowhere, Uncle Donny grabs Major Howell and he kicks him out the goddamn door! Oh, shit! Room goes dead quiet. Uncle Donny just trucks. Got to surprise the boy on his birthday. <laughs> Was there a point to your story? Surprises. They fill me with dread and anxiety. Getting bumpy out there, team. Might want to buckle in. What the hell? Scratch that. Strap your shoots on. I ain't stopping on the island, but this storm might have a off to a promising start, eh? Oh, shit! <laughs> This is Mark. Anyone else make it? Hello? Hey, what's that? A beacon? Could be the others. Should try to find a source. Damn little hog grunt saving my life by kicking me out the bloody plane. Crash a jungle gasket to me. I got bigger things planned. Survive. One for the history books, eh, Chuckles? Chuckles? You were the only one who laughed at my story. <laughs> Fair enough. Good. Four survivors. Lieutenant Kalisa, reporting for duty, sir. Thanks for waiting. Appreciate it. 
We're patient people, chuckles and eh? <laughs> Teams back together. Now what? You all follow the beacon, right? We'll find a way up to it. Keegan, anyone read me? That's not too promising. Uh, get a beacon signal, though. Could be the others. We all got clear the condo. Hope they're out there. What the hell? You're going to the sewer. What about the rest of us? Uh, Rooks? Never thought you were cowards. What the hell was that? This place is bringing up some bad memories. Need to get out of here. Hope the others made it. Anybody there? Lieutenant Kaliso, reporting for duty, sir. Glad you made it, soldier. You good? Huh. Bit banged up, but I'll survive. Any sign of the outsider? Nigga. Kid! You out there? <coughs> Reunited at last. You made it. Well, thanks to you, Cog. Goddamn maniac kicking me out of a burning plane. Well, outsider, seems like I should get a thank you, seeing as you're alive. You're assuming I want to be alive. <laughs> <clears throat> the team's back together. Now what? You all follow the beacon, right? Let's find a way up to it. Copy? Damn it. Could be. could be the others. Should get to the source ASAP. <coughs> What's going on? If you have just followed orders. <coughs> Hell am I? Well, I might be stranded, but it's a far shot better than being locked in my cell.
Glad you made it, soldier. Lieutenant Kalisa, reporting for duty, sir. You good? <laughs> Bit banged up, but I'll survive. Any sign of the outsider? Nick. Kid, you out there? <laughs> Reunited at last. You made it. Well, thanks to you, Cog. Goddamn maniac kicking me out of a burning plane. Well, outsider, seems like I should get a thank you. You're, You're assuming I want to be <clears throat> <clears throat> Teams back together. Now what? You all follow the beacon, right? Let's find a way up to it. Well, that is what fucked up, Lynn. There's no way that radio's operational. We need to eliminate it as an option before we move on to another plan. Come on! Hey! You still there? What? Well, you made it! This is Dak. I'm here to get you. Got a location? On it! Why do we get the feeling that Tak isn't the only one we signal? Juvie's income! And nice shoot! Bring it her in! Nightmare. Here's the results. Right. Sorry to be late and all. We survived a horrific condor crash, fought an endless horde of monsters from hell, and barely escaped with our lives. But uh, how's your day been? Well, it's about goddamn time. Holy shit. What? Show some respect. It's Colonel Victor Hoffman. It's an honor, sir. A real hell of an honor. Shared sentiment, soldier? That's why you're here. Best of the best. This here's Hannah Colt. She's my number one on this covert operation. She knows a lot about science things and uh, is, uh, well, in, in general, quite pleasant to be around. Advanced degrees in biochemistry, toxicology, chemistry, and science things. Thanks, Hoff. Anyway, good to finally meet you. What kind of operation is this? Hannah? Now, what we're looking at is a schematic of the Pahanu Cog Bunker, designation Sanctum. It never served its true purpose, instead becoming a burial site at the end of the Locust War. And now, well, it's a full-blown swarm hive. I need you to infiltrate and plant a chemical bomb at its heart so we can kill them from the inside out. It's a high-risk mission. But if we get this right, we can wipe out those bastards and use what we've learned to save the entire goddamn planet. Now, I've made promises to the COG, and through my people on the mainland, I've made promises to you. Complete the objective, and I will deliver. Questions? 
Whatever the mission, sir, we're in. What? Beats the hell out of retirement. <laughs> well then, what are we waiting for? All right, team. You'll be infiltrating the base from its main entrance. All of our recon efforts indicate it remains fully powered by the thermal reactor. Once inside, you'll need to access the bottom floor. It's 20 levels down, but the elevator system will ease the burden. What kind of recon operation did you run? We sent a few teams of DVs, but lost contact. The truth is, we needed somebody with access. Keegan, you're up. I'm on. We're in! Let's go! We will fight our way inch by fucking inch if that's what it takes. We all took this mission to make a difference. And we have our orders, outsider. Now, let's make it count. I want our sacrifice to matter. Take a look around. We have to face the facts. The way things are going, this will all be for nothing. So, Lonnie, we almost there. Not even close. Uh, we made it this far. We'll find another way down. <laughs> Goddamn cog. Just can't admit defeat, can you? I'm done taking shit from you, boy. <laughs> to hell with the objective. The hell you doing? Making it count, brother. Move! Deadly toxin detected. All personnel must vacate safety. Don't stop! Oh. It'll, It'll kill us too! Keep moving!
or we would have died for nothing. That wasn't the mission. That's your decision. Uh, well, I think we can all agree the mission was a failure. Not if we uncovered new data. Anything? The drones, Juvies, roasted them. Heavier swarm. We didn't have the punch we needed. You got anything stronger? Mm. Something that can sink the entire island, maybe. But how about a few canisters of that nightmare acid that killed all them bastards on the beach, eh? Damn. You might be onto something. I was joking. Even if that could work, there's a problem. We don't know what's responsible for the attack or where to find it. Why, Leahy? My grand used to tell me stories about her people. How the young men and women would travel the ocean to face a god. It was their rite of passage. If anyone knows something about what we saw on the beach, it's my grandmother's people. Well, go then. Make contact. See what you can learn. Anna, you prep for field work. I want you there to ask the right questions. I'm on it. Let's go, Scorpio. better already. All right. Let's see what we can learn from the locals. What's the plan with attacking, Hannah? If we obtain some of that nightmare acid from whatever attacked the swarm of the Connie, we can combine it with the toxin I was sent from New Hope. Hopefully someone here can listen on what exactly that acid is and how to get it. We still have to find a better way to the heart of the hive. Yep. I'm working on a solution to that, too. Never thought I'd see where my family came from. Even with all the stories and memories she shared. Brad never told me why she left. Any of your family still live here? Distant relatives, I'm sure. I guess I should introduce myself. Feels like an odd way to reconnect, you know? Marching in, middle of the night. Oh, I'm sure we'll be given a warm welcome. Not every day a band of armed soldiers wanders into town. Well, hopefully they'll be understanding given our rather dire circumstances. In? They're at the hall, right? And we are trying to get there. So, Hannah, we mean to ask. You any relation to the coal trade? Right. Because every coal is related to Augustus. Sorry. Was just curious, is all. <laughs> Getting a sense you hear that question more than you'd like to. No, it's okay. I like my dad. I mean, yes. He's my dad. Just please, please don't ask me about Thrash Ball. I find it tedious. Augustus Cole. You know I saw him play, but that ain't what I remember him for. Man to legend. A true definition of the Cog frontline hero. Yeah, you aren't wrong, Keegan. That's what everyone sees in my father. I wanted to be just like him. A lot of people find it hard to believe, but at home, the Cole train. He's a quiet man, thoughtful even. His introspection about the war kept me far from the military. He wanted more from me. That's what I fought for, baby. Dad said, one serum with an education could do more to turn the tide of war than a single grunt with a gun ever could. You mentioned your degrees back when we first met. That's, uh, that's a lot to know for a kid. <laughs> yeah. Mom was always buying me books. Books for my birthday, books for special holidays. Had books out my ass. Interesting. Oh, I loved it. I think it was a distraction to keep me away from what my dad was interested in. War? Sports. 
And I still don't want to talk about Thrash Ball. How'd you meet Hoffman? Through Dad. Hoffman had the idea for this special project after what happened at New Hope. He got his hands on the New Hope toxin, but needed a specialist to do anything with it. And so, here I am, working on a plan to save the world. You know, Hoffman's been working on this plan for a long time. But when I first got here, he mostly rolled around in his wheelchair yelling out the window. He really hates the first one. All right. Let's hope there's someone in here willing to help. Well, that all depends on how long their party's been going on. No. Everyone's gone. God damn it. Looks like this ain't a diplomatic mission anymore. Can someone turn off that damn radio? Hey, Lonnie. Take a look at this. All this imagery around a creature of some kind. Can you read the language? It's been a long time since Graham told me what they are. But I can try. This scroll references the Awakening. It's the rite of passage she talked about. Listen. The mantle. Terror stalks and desires to consume. Let it be your burden, but let it not feed. The journey. Our ancestors carry you across the world. Their spirits guide and watch over you. Spirit walk. Enter the Fade and journey amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. Fear. Awaken. Reborn. Renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden. Transformed. Light as the feather. Face the creature. Ha! Huh. Looks like a big fucking bird. A bird? Feathers. Huh? Gran would tell me stories about the Wakatu, a blind demon that all children must face as a rite of passage. Are you suggesting that thing at the beach? Yes, the Wakatu isn't mythology. It's real. That's it. We track this Wakatu down and get a sample of its poison. Hey, after we figure out what's going on here. We'll find the villagers. Come on, Scorpio. Could be further into the village. Through here. Snipers. Shit. What the hell did those bastards get here? How are we gonna handle this? We kill the swarm. Every last one of them. We're clear. There's no bodies. No sign of the villagers. Where'd they go? They have more use for us alive, buddy. Those any pods here, though. They take them somewhere. A defensible structure. The temple up on the ridge. You can still save them. Let's go. Huh. You doing okay, Hannah? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Good. We've got your back. That's right. Thanks, guys. There are stories of people who survived being snatched and pot. But. We need to be prepared for the reality that those chances are often slim. I'm not giving up on them. Let's get to the temple. If anyone's in here, they need our help. Come on. Look, in the 
tree. They collected feathers from the Wakatu and brought them here. No pods, though. No bodies. The toxin coming from the feathers. It seems to have some kind of psychological effect. Makes you hear stuff, right? Stuff you'd rather not think about. Yeah. Yeah. But this incense, it's negating the toxic effects. We saw the same incense in the ritual room, back on Pahanu when we first landed. This proves that we can find the Wakatu. But right now, we need to find the villagers. Let's move. Get the door. One day too late. One day makes all the difference. They're gone. We couldn't save them. So, what the hell are we going to do about it? The fuckers pay! Now we're on the same page, sister. fate on their entire species. I still don't understand how they got here from Pahanu. Looks like we found an answer, Hannah. The lava tubes. This is how they got here. Lava tubes? Then maybe they're connecting the islands. Hannah, above you! I can't handle.
Nagatsu made quick work of the swarm. I feel good about Hana's toxin plan. If we can manage to catch that thing. I'm not sure we can do it alone. Agreed. Now's the time to ask Hoffman to bring in some reinforcements. Keegan, this is not a cold mission. What? What the hell are you talking about? Hoffman's gone rogue. It's just us. Colonel Hoffman is a decorated COG veteran. Aye, but just think for a second. The access codes to Sanctum. If Hoffman's working with the COG, why couldn't he just get those codes himself? That's... Uh, oh, that's ridiculous. I don't know why this is such a surprise. My back. Why would Hoffman lie to us? Hoffman's used to doing whatever it takes to get the job done. Oh shit! This way! <laughs> Operation? Why would everything be so goddamn secret? When we got here, we had no clue where we were going. Nick, not the time. Damn it! Knew we couldn't shake it for long. The minister rejected my plan to deal with the swarm. She said her damn robots could handle them. So I used my forced retirement to uh, launch a mission of my own. All this time, we were on a goddamn rogue operation? That's right. Look, I know your past. That you've all suffered and struggled, but you've still got that fight in you. Purpose. That's why we're here. It was our lives on the line. The fate of the entire planet is on the line, soldier. I'm not here to save the world. The swarm took my son. Dragged him. Screaming into the dark. I failed to protect him. To fight for him. I joined up to make these fuckers pay. And I planned to die doing it. But here we are. So, to hell with it. I'll live. And I'll fight for what family I have left. I won't stand by and watch more people suffer. Not when I can do something about it. We know how to get to the heart of the hive. All I need is one sample. And you'll get it. But I won't let my brother face this one alone. Wish I could have been there for you, Mac. And your son. But I'm here now. Well, 
That's it then. Once more into the screaming dark. Like my ancestors have done for generations. Enter the Fade and walk amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. There's our path. I'll be down. I'm leaving out what my parents and bride used to believe was mythology, just stories. I was in prison when Grand passed. I wish she could see me now. It's none of my business, but... It's okay. We're squad now. You both should know. I fucked up. Deliberately ignored an order. Thought I knew better than everyone else, and someone got killed. See you. A good man. Truth is, as much as I want to go back, I don't know if there's a spot waiting for me. Wow. What's this? Some kind of effigy. My father used to carve pieces like it from wood. He said they would protect us from dark spirits. Your old job. Still uh, classified? No. I can still. I was part of the Brash Brigade. Locust cleanup crew. Cleanup crew? Some of the locusts survived the war. We made them disappear. Why? So, the emulsion countermeasure and so on. As far as the public knows, the war ended there. But there was still more work to be done. Newbies have worn out their work. Oh, poor Lieutenant. Never got the long story about your rank. Onyx Guard fought like hell in the war. What would hold up a promotion? After all of us were fighting, I was stationed on Azura, doing basically guard duty. Onyx exiles and guards. No glory, no rank, no purpose for all those years. I'm sorry, Keegan. I don't know about all this rank stuff, but what you're doing here, this matters, brother. Thanks. I appreciate that. Let's push on. Need a hand here. That tree there. It was on the path in the village hall. It must be the Wakatu's nest. Then we're still on the right path. You know, before all this, I really thought my life was over. That I'd live out the rest of my days in prison. And so you joined up when Hoffman's crony found you, hmm? Exactly. Same here. What else can you do when you've lost everything? Grand's final words to me were about struggle. How my sufferings would define the true line of the weak or the strong. I wanted to know which I'd be. She said, live and discover for yourself. That's the journey. I think I would have liked it. It doesn't matter how hard we tried to run from our past. Everything we did let us hear. Led us to this island, a thousand miles from the war. This time I'm gonna make a goddamn difference. I thought this was my chance to prove myself. To the Brash Brigade, to the memory of my CO. My gran was right. The path of my life would determine who I'd become. They brought me home, here, and gave me a new family. That goes for all of us. You said I had to all the lost to find home, Scorpio. 
I say we fight like hell to save it. This is it. Fear. The Bokatu wants to swarm off this island as much as we do. We should try to get the sample without killing it. Agreed. Be good to see the natural order restored. But he might have other plans. But he might have other plans.
ammo! That's your way!
renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden, transformed. Light as the feather. Put up one hell of a fight. You, uh, think it'll live? Yeah, I do. It's a good day. Everyone survives. you to know. It's your fault, and I'm gonna fucking haunt you. How's your nerves, Major Howe? Oh, to hell with my anxiety. This time, I'm the surprise. See you on the other side. 